airport currently contributes around £160 million a year to the local economy and we employ around 950 people on the site itself. Over the next 20 years and through the proposals published in our master plan, we'll grow that economic contribution to around £400 million per year and we'll increase the number of staff employed on site by 50% to 1,500 over the next 20 years. Southampton Airport already engages with local authorities ensuring we provide passengers with a frequent and reliable public transport service. In fact, we are in one of the top airports in the country for ease and accessibility when it comes to public transport, with Southampton Parkway already being just 99 steps away from the terminal. More than a quarter of our passengers already use this public transport and our surface access strategy will look to develop this further in years to come. My hopes for Southampton Airport over the next 20 years are that we continue to maintain our position as one of the easiest airports in the country um, and that we do that by uh, at the same time as offering as much choice as we can to our uh, local passengers who don't then have to trot all the way up to uh, London airports to, to go to the same destination. With the proposed terminal extension, the customer experience is going to be vastly improved. There's going to be more room, a bigger arrivals hall, a bigger departure lounge, a new security area and a greater retail and catering offer for our passengers. So the draft master plan that we've published uh, identifies that we could extend the runway within our boundary and we're looking at approximately 170 metres but it'd be importantly be within the fence that we have at the moment. With any major project it's very important that we plan to make sure that the passengers are not affected so that their journey is still seamless during such major construction works. My aspirations for the airport over the next 20 years are to fulfil the proposals as set out in our master plan. That enables us to expand our route network and to massively increase the economic contribution that the airport makes to the local community and in doing that provide a 50% increase in the number of jobs on site. Overall, I can see a massive opportunity for Southampton Airport to increase its gateway status for the local region and provide a far improved service for businesses and the local community.